Hi everyone. Today we're going to do some research into the 4th of July and the month of July that's coming up for 2014. There is a lot of evidence that the Freemasons and Illuminati have a lot of different things around the world actually set up for this time of the year. We don't know if something is going to happen during this year 2014, but there is a large star alignment that they have set up right in Washington with the Washington Monument and is for, it is for the 4th of July. And it is aligned with, you can see here the Washington Monument, up to the Dog Star Sirius, and then up to the Pallades. And the Pallades is actually has its funnel pointing down at this time. Now this is all shown in the Bible. There is a balance on Earth. Most people will only see all of this stuff and they will think it's like this is the stairway to, to the devil. I mean, I'm sorry, but the devil does not own the heavens and such. The Pallades is actually shown as a heavenly realm. It is in Jesus' right hand. In the book of Revelation, he says to seven stars, to seven angels, to seven sisters, to seven churches, to seven golden candlesticks, all represent heaven in his right hand. And that is it right there. This is like a gate opening to heaven. This would also be the same time that they would cast down the accuser, as they call in the Bible, which is the day of the rapture event also when a great cataclysm comes upon the earth and all of Jesus' wise virgins ascend. But you can see all of this right here. It has actually also been set up for September 15th, so we don't know about an actual date. But we have this right here, right in front of us. Now I wanted to show, they have a lot of different paintings the Freemasons had done by this gentleman named Wayne Herschel. And this one here showing George Washington of the past this, this whole collection, a 22 painting collection, showing the number 22 again, that we've been showing on our channel a lot. The 22 comes up a lot. But this is showing the future event, even though it's painted in the past. You can see this gentleman is just like Obama here. But you have the Earth. See the Earth over here? And George Washington is protecting the Pallades. See how this has a P right on it? And it has See how it's like a woman? See how it, the cloth on there makes sure it looks like a woman? A woman's hair? And you have this urn. This urn is associated with Pandora's box because Pandora's box was also seen as an urn. See right here? An urn. Most people just call it a box. But you can see this here. This is supposed to be that day coming. It's all set up. They are even making a gallows in the back. They are making the guillotines. That on this day, this is the accuser in red coming with Obama here. And that is when this Pandora's box is opened, the time of trouble of the Bible. And that is when everybody goes to the place prepared for them that are with Jesus. Over and over again this is shown. Now a while back this same man named Wayne Herschel was going on thinking that that Washington was going to be struck because he had deciphered some of Nostradamus' prophecies. And you can see this right here. This is one of Nostradamus' prophecies. At the fourth pillar, which represents the end of the fourth age, which they dedicate to Saturn, like Washington has an alignment with Saturn maybe, split by earthquake and now by flood. Under Saturn's mon monument, an urn is found. See this? and the gold is carried off and then restored supposedly just as if all the gold going off of the rapture and the urn is opened the great tribulation begins I've been showing this over and over again that it's mapped out all around us this is Washington right here this is the White House right here they show that day coming see how this is called the ellipse like an alignment and down here is the Washington Monument See how it is set up for the alignment of the star systems? These are supposed to be like an ellipse, an ecliptical ellipse. See how this is an eye? And when this perfect alignment happens, the eye of the needle will be opened. And that's when we can get into heaven. It's all coordinated. And right here, this represents the foot of Jesus Christ. And when his heel is bruised, this football is kicked. The same day the USA is judged and falls is the same day the serpent 
receives a grievous head wound. See this right here? And we are kicked through, just like this goalpost. We go right through into heaven. That's what this whole thing is mapped out to show. As I've been showing, the Bible is a perfect balance. It's all going to go by scripture. Even Satan's side is written to happen in there, and it's all going according to what's supposed to happen. When this perfect alignment happens, is it this July 4th? Is it September 15th? I don't know. Who knows? But we do have the urn, and we have all of these things right in front of us. See the urn? Everybody should recognize this. We are going to go from here, the earth, over to here, to the Pleiades, the place prepared for us. And this urn is going to be opened at that time. Great tribulation will be coming across the earth. The whole earth is mapped out to show this coming. Let's get rid of this. On the day the USA falls, it's all planned. It's going according to scripture. That is when the box will be opened. The little horn of the Bible coming out of Pandora's box right here. All perfect. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart. God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. So you can see all this alignment that's worked out right here to get into Jesus' right hand. That is Jesus' right hand right there where he says he has prepared heaven for everybody. Our souls and all have to get here. And that this is showing that that is when the alignment is right. You can see the, the Pallades has its little funnel pointed right down to the stairs. See here? All perfect. Right in front of us. So let's continue on. And please let me know what research you have heard of for this. And let's keep, keep on researching everything.